you needed some coins to build that dream team you guys have always wanted, head on over to my sponsor, Buy Madden Coins. They have the cheapest, the quickest, and the most reliable coins on the market right now. Make sure to use code Poodle for 20% off at checkout. Hey, what's going on, everybody? It's Poodle back with another Madden Ultimate Team video guide. And today, it's Legend Saturday. It is here, boys. Brand new legends in the game. The legends have been pretty fire lately. Not gonna lie. So most of the drops have been getting pretty fire. Kickoff promo was that but the cards for kick out promo were good it was just the way they constructed the promo just wasn't all there so thank god we still have legend saturday some market lowering some crashing some other things to look forward to some mud 10 legends that's all we got to look forward to right now on so at least the mud heroes promo because kick out promo wasn't constructed well enough in my opinion we as madden players have a consistency that we like in this game we usually can expect how a promo will go and why we're gonna love it so to change it and then to make it even worse just didn't really make sense to me guys but we have legend saturday today we got the brand new legends today so we gotta be hype about that boys you know legend saturday is always a good day to pick up some new players enjoy some new drops get other cards you've been wanting because with these positions typically the positions they drop will lower other positions in the game so let's say they drop a quarterback and a wide receiver Typically quarterbacks and wide receivers that are worse than them will come down So this is a good day to pick up some guys legend pieces come out legend fantasy packs are out legend bundles are out it, It's a great day legend Saturday One of my favorite days in Madden in the week Especially if they drop some heat and I'm really kind of liking the cards today I'm liking one of the cards specifically the other card and it's all right because now they drop back-to-back -back days of these kind of cards But this one I'm kind of really feeling now guys before we get into this video make sure you go down below Give this video a big thumbs up. It is a content video, guys, but it will be the first thing you guys see today. So make sure you give it a thumbs up. Let's get this video to 150 likes, guys. It's a content video, but smash the like button. It helps my channel out tremendously when you guys smash the like button. So make sure you smash it. Go down below. Turn on the noti bell. Make sure to hit that subscribe button, guys. We're so close to 8K. We're literally 80 subscribers away from 8K. So make sure you go hit it. Go hit the sub button. It won't hurt you guys. Help me out a lot. I'm trying to grow here. And comment down below what you guys think of these legends. I personally like one of them a lot. The second one I'm kind of iffy on, for my team at least. Not that he's a bad legend, but for my team, iffy. The first one, I really do like. So comment down below what you guys think of these legends. Hopefully you guys are seeing this video by like 10, 25, 10, 30. This should be going live for you guys. So hopefully you see it by then, right in time for them to come out, guys. So you guys will know my opinion. Now, they obviously aren't out yet, but I do have the Twitter images. I've been doing that a lot lately because I'm able to get it out to you guys pretty quickly. And I'm able to show you guys the same things anyways. And it kind of helps me with my timing schedule making other videos. I do have three for you guys coming today. So let's get into these legend guys. First things first. We got a wide receiver and a right end. And yesterday they did drop Julius Peppers at left end, I believe. So today they dropped the right end. They dropped the wide receiver. They did just drop Hopkins. But guys, we got Howie Long, right end for the Raiders. Pretty good. Pretty cool. His stats are looking, are, they're looking pretty good. Not going to lie. Not going to lie about that. But the guy that I'm really excited, they dropped T.O., Mr. Terrell Owens, the guy who just declined apparently the Hall of Fame, or at least the Invitational for it. I don't know what's going on with him, but his card stats look pretty nice. I kind of want him. He's kind of a beast. 49ers. Let's head on over to Twitter, guys, so we can go show you guys all the stats and everything, and then go over a few little recommendations I have for you guys. Let's head on over to Twitter. All right, guys, so first thing, we got Howie Long, right end for the Raiders. He has that cancel out looking chemistry. Don't really know what that means. Again, I have not dwelled into chemistries too much just yet, especially archetypes is what I should say. He can be powered up obviously, so he will be having a training option today. Howie Long, Legends card, 91 overall. Okay, so they're sticking with the 91 overall trend for now. I think these should be coming up to a 92 by maybe next Legend Saturday or maybe the following. He's six foot five, so he's massive, just like Julius Peppers is. Not as big, but he's, he's getting there. 79 speed, a little on the slower side. But again, for an end, it's fast. It's not slow for an end. It's slow in general. But for an end, it's not too bad. Although we did just get a Peppers who has like an 84 speed. But again, you could easily power up that Peppers and get a card faster than this one. But his underlying stats are what's important here, guys. He's got 85 Excel. That's really good. That kind of makes up for the speed. 89 Strength. That's Threshold Strength if you power him up. 86 Tackle. Again, if you power him up and you chem him up, could be Threshold Tackling. 90 play rec threshold play rec 90 block shed threshold block shed 90 power move threshold power move 82 finesse move guys this card right here he gets one two three four thresholds this is going to be a beastly right end one of probably the best right end in the game right now at least up there definitely blows aaron donald out of the water well you picking him up no but remember guys you can always always just go get his power up card 
power him up to an 89 for like 100k and you have aaron donald you'll have a you'll have a howie long style aaron donald at right end and he'll be equally as good if not better for you guys and be a lot cheaper now will this lower how um, aaron donald's price most likely but howie long will get another card after this for quite a while i know aaron donald will that's why i'm fine sticking with aaron donald for the time being but for the most part this card is insane this is a card that most teams should want to have i just like longevity and saving being efficient with my coins if you guys have a ton of coins go pick them up if you're starting to save your coins i'll stick with my aaron donald for now he'll get an upgrade within the next month or so he'll continue to be the top right end he'll get upgrades all year i kind of like having modern day players on my team too because they will get more upgrades throughout the year than these legend cards and not all and even when they do get upgrades they want to get them for a long time until madden's like almost dead so that's kind of why i stray away from those now let's head on over to terrell owens right here coming in terrell owens 91 overall wide receiver on the san francisco 49ers he's got that looking running archetype there don't know what that means i wonder what the glitchy wide receiver cam is going to be this year like if you guys haven't realized we have evasive for running backs and arm bar and bruiser and you know wrecking ball for quarterbacks we got escape artist and fast break gunslinger you know bazooka uh rolling dead eye we got all those we got all that cool stuff but then i wonder what we'll have for like wide receivers in some other positions i haven't seen anything kind of crazy for them just yet Maybe certain wide receivers just can't get it yet. Or maybe it's double me. I really don't know yet. But if you guys know that, comment that down below. Let's get into his stats. He's 6'3", 89 speed, crazy speed. That's some crazy speed on a TO card. 90 jumping, 88 catching, 90 catching traffic, 88 spec, 86 short route running, 84 medium route running, 84 deep route running. You power this guy up. This TO is going to have a 90 speed, 91 jumping, about 90 catching, 90 catch and traffic, about 90 spec catch. He's gonna have thresholds catching, catch and traffic, and spec catch, and threshold jumping. He's six foot three monster. He's a six foot three monster, and he's gonna have above 90 speed. This card is going to be Tyreek. Uh, if Tyreek Kill took steroids and could catch, this would be Tyreek. This would be Trollones. I really want to pick up this card. The only issue for me is gonna be by the way I have my team constructed. Unless I sell Tyreek Kill, which I think will probably be a good idea at this point because this card's coming out way faster than him. And he's going to be hurt for quite some time. So I think, honestly, selling Tyreek Hill might be the move. But Terrell Owens is looking like a beast, honestly. Might have to scoop up his at least his power-up or something on my team. I really like this card. Not, and I, I've kind of been like a TO fan lately, so it could really go back with that. Let's get back over onto the Madden screen. Let's go over my last little tips I got for Legend Saturday for you guys. All right, so we're back on the Madden screen, guys. First thing you're going to want to do is come on over to Challenges once they're released. You want to go over to Legends right up here and oh i clicked on fill out picks okay legends and there's gonna be week one two three four five six seven and now what you're concerned with is week eight wow that is crazy we already have eight legend drops in madden time is really flying here guys but when they do drop legend week eight you're gonna want to go play them like i always tell you guys if you get the legend solos done right away when they come out you could sell their power up for a pretty decent price off the bat initially if you guys see oh, i got really close to the camera there my bad if you guys look right here it only takes let's see how many stars it takes for their power one star so you play it on easy you do literally the bare minimum you just chew clock the whole game in literally three possessions you can just run the ball 100 times kill the clock when week eight drops there'll be a terrell owen solo sequence and a howie long solo sequence go in there get their power ups. you could probably sell both their power ups for a minimum of like 12 13k each right off the bat maybe even more 20 30k i've seen people sell brian dawkins power for 50k and they sell i'm not kidding brian dawkins power i was watching sell 50k if people like terrell owens as much as i think they will you could take that terrell owens power probably put it up for like 20k put the howie long up for like 15k 20k make a quick 40k right off the bat and then you have to wait a few hours and then they'll be back down to like 5 and 6k and you can buy them right back trust me that is the smartest thing to do so make sure you go and play them right off the bat obviously if you're slow people will beat you to it and then obviously you won't be getting the price you need to but if you can get it done quickly it could be a good thing like i said i had to go play the solos for brian dawkins as you guys can see here i had to go play the solos because people were putting brian dawkins up for 60k and i was watching him sell and i wasn't i wasn't having it but i highly recommend you do that pretty quickly guys and if i had to power them up honestly not a bad idea you can get terrell owens and howie long to an 89 overall which terrell owens at an 89 will be one of the best receivers in the game and howie long as a 89 overall right end will be better than aaron donald most likely so again one of the best ends in the game very very useful that probably cost you a grand total of like 200k training and don't just do it because i said so obviously do it like okay am i going to keep terrell owens for a while don't just do it use him for a little bit and then get rid of him if you're not going to keep him for long term don't bother just buy the full card and sell them when you're ready but for me there's like guys that i want to keep long term that's why i have aaron donald powered up brian dawkins powered up there's a lot of things that are useful for me so that's why i do it but guys it's obviously your decision 
make educated choices. Don't just do things because you hear them on YouTube. Always make sure to do your own math or get your own calculator and double check. Because not everything you hear is always the most accurate or should I say even the most opinionated or biased to, to you. It's biased for me. That's what comes out of my mouth. So just make sure you always check everything, guys. Hope you guys enjoy, enjoy these Legend Saturday drop. Hopefully you guys are seeing this by 10.30 and I did get it out in time. If not, guys, something, my internet crapped itself or something. But if it's not up by 10.30, I apologize. Hopefully it is. That's about it. Thank you guys so much for watching. Enjoy the rest of your Legend Saturday. Make sure to go down below. Hit the subscribe button. Hopefully we can hit AK by today. We're about 70 subscribers away. Make sure to comment down below what you think of these Legends. And drop 150 likes in the video, boys. That's about it. Thank you so much for watching. Enjoy your day. I'm out. See you guys next video. Peace.